Uh, my name is Daniel Christie. I'm a soph currently a sophomore, almost a pre-junior in material science and engineering. Uh, and there's, there's, not, there's not a single day that goes by where I don't use the library resources in some capacity, whether that's journal publications or engineering standards I need to reference. Uh, being a full-time researcher on my first co-op, uh, the library is an integral part of my success. My name is Destiny John. I am a sophomore. I am a bio biology student. I did use the group study room a couple of times because I had to do group projects, especially for my um, biology research papers. They, we were usually in groups and the best place to go for us was the group study room. As well as one time I did kind of break my computer for a week. <laughs> it didn't work so I had to use the library, I mean I had to use the library and the computers there. I'm Nick Kotcher. I'm a computer engineering major here at Drexel University. The vastness of the online catalogs too, not only is there a large collection of books, obviously physical books, but as a computer engineering major I like to read up about the newest languages and there's such a online library that you can read a lot of ebooks as well. Hi, my name is Candice Young and I'm an electrical engineer at Drexel University. Engineering 102 was the hardest uh, project I had to do this year. We had to program a robot to do a series of tasks, but it definitely could have helped if I looked up some stuff in the library to help me with programming the robot and um, figuring out how to handle it and build the mechanics of it too. Uh, there's plenty of, of resources here uh, to help you, but you have to be aware of them. Um, the, mistake I, the mistake that we see a lot of people um, make in the first year is, is not reach out either to their academic advisors or to the librarians or use the library search tools. Most freshmen I meet are not even aware uh, of the library search and I think they're just, they're just using Google or Wikipedia uh, and I'm thinking guys the, the library it's this, it's this treasure trove here. Make sure to use all of your resources around you. Um, don't think that you could do everything by yourself. As far as library resources I really have enjoyed all of the events that I've come to here. I went to a few events about uh, presentation skills that I definitely thought were helpful and I definitely recommend going to as many library events as you can or at least to think about them and to look into what ones there are. Take advantage of the resources and like they'll help you do your research if you need it. I didn't take advantage of that and I probably could have gotten way better grades on my briefs and reports. Uh, my high school library, I knew it was there but like you barely talk to the librarian unless if you go there. And it's not like for there you could only go during lunch time and so you can use it for other times unless if it's after class if it's still open. Uh, but here you could go like whenever you have time and do whatever you want, need to do right there. As well as um, here you barely use when you when you come into the library you see that everybody is studying or doing something like educational, not just like sitting there and doing nothing. So my personal librarian was Kenneth, and I got a few emails from him throughout the term. I didn't really take too much advantage of him toward, until about um, probably the winter term when I had my English 102 course, at which point we had some projects. And I was just curious about some of the ways that we do research at the Drexel Library. So I actually emailed him and I was able to sit down with him. And he kind of walked me through the resources that we have and how to go about using the Drexel resources to do good research. I did get emails from um, Brett from Peggy, who was my personal librarian. Uh, one time I did contract her based on a research paper that I had to do. Uh, I, I think like um, if you need any help with your research, it's a good idea to go to them if you have no clue where to start. Because I have, I think she helped me quite a lot. 